zero. We have booster ignition and liftoff of the Space Shuttle Endeavour. Some 21st century explorers who made their discoveries in rocket ships are paying tribute to some pioneers who traveled by wooden ships almost 400 years ago. NASA has teamed with Jamestown 2007 to help Americans embrace the spirit of exploration, then, now, and in the future. Cast off your lines and make ready to set sail. The past is embodied by a replica of the Godspeed, one of three sailing vessels that brought the first English colonists to Jamestown, Virginia in 1607. That replica and its crew of 13 are making six major port calls on the East Coast, including Baltimore, New York City, and Boston. It's a kickoff to an 18-month-long celebration of the 400th anniversary of the founding of Jamestown. So you guys can take a chance a little bit later to learn about how these sailors navigated using dead reckoning. Modern explorers like former NASA astronaut Roger Crouch now use computer technology to navigate. But there are similarities between the Godspeed and space capsules and orbiters. Both are relatively small, especially compared to the vastness of the areas in which they travel. Both set off on high-risk missions into unknown territory with the possibility of changing life as we know it. It's all part of the human spirit. And so all of us are really explorers and the quality of our life and what we learn and the new things we have, new adventures we have in our life are totally determined by how willing we are to explore and try new things and be willing to fail. Visitors to the Godspeed sale can try new things, courtesy of NASA. Among the exhibits offered at every tour stop, a personalized postcard from space and a chance to take a picture as an astronaut. <laughs>